The United Arab Emirates has requested that its ancient Dubai Creek be listed in UNESCO's World Heritage in an effort to boost local tourism. UNESCO will put the creek through a series of evaluations before it announces the result in June. The 14-kilometer river divides Dubai into two sections and is greatly responsible for the city's formation. Many people started to settle along the riverside, which sparked the area's sea trade. Uh, since 1903, Dubai became a very important harbor for the commerce in the uh, Gulf, uh, Arabian Gulf. And a lot of merchants and a lot of people came to the city and it developed with its uh, souks, with the markets, with the houses, the winter warehouses and so. So all of these we are taking as a combination to be registered with UNESCO. The village along the riverside showcases ancient architectural styles, such as wind, houses and mosques. Dubai residents are able to ferry across the waterway on a little wooden boat for only 30 U.S. cents. We had uh, about uh, 10 million uh, visitors uh, last year, tourists in Dubai. And according to their plan, by 2020, we want to reach it to 20 million. So this is a very important part because a lot of tourists, when they go and visit any country, the first thing they look on the internet, which uh, UNESCO sites they have in that country. The United Arab Emirate currently owns one World Heritage Site, the culture sites of Al Ain Museum, where many ancient artifacts dating back to 25 BC have been unearthed. The government okay. is planning to apply for an additional six cultural sites to UNESCO in the future.